This is FYI on your TV, brought to you by Hometown News. I'm Kathy Botham. I've got Margo Hallam back in the studio with me. We've been doing this for, by Zoom for the last couple of years, yeah. so nice to have you back Thanks here. very much for having me. You are the Executive Director of the Perth and Smith Falls District Hospital Foundation. How long have you been doing that? Two years since we amalgamated this month, so for this foundation, two years. Let, let's talk about the last two years, because we did it during COVID, yeah, too, but yeah. phenomenal things have happened. This is much nicer. We've been very busy, and we've been very uh, appreciative of the community supporting the new foundation and building the legacy that we've had over the many, many years that we uh, had separately, I guess, as far as Perth and Smith Falls goes. So yeah, like this past year, we've had a lot going on. We've been very fortunate. We had our CP Women's Open Golf Tournament that uh, Canadian Pacific their Golf for Heart program matched $250,000. Amazing. So we raised the $250,000. They matched it. So that was $500,000 that's coming to our hospital for heart care and, and cardiac care within our area. And we had the Smile Cookie campaign that was so much fun. We had our board involved with that. and You got to go out and decorate the cookies did. too. Oh, we did. We did. And, and uh, that was interesting. So everybody got special cookies from our foundation anyway when they came. And... Giving Tuesday was great. Lake Radio, or the Lake 88 Radiothon was a great partner. Our our um, service clubs in town are fabulous with you us. You were up at the crack of dawn before the sun came we up. I remember listening to that. You were up. Oh my way gosh! Early. You know, and it, it. I'm up early anyway. But when you're up and out and trying to get on the radio and actually sound like you're supposed to sound, I don't know how. You, I don't know how they do it. Like kudos to everybody that's up bright and early. But it was a great day. Mm -hmm. You know, it really was a great day, and we're very, 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 very fortunate to have those type of third party events that happen within our community for a hospital. So we're very grateful. That's right, that's right. So looking forward <coughs> this year, you've got a, a lot of events going on too. We do, you know what, and it's nice. Like you said, we're sort of getting to the end of the, co like I hope to the end of COVID where we can do some more face-to-face -face, um, outings out there. So we are coming back with our golf tournament in June. We are also doing a family fun day in May, the last Saturday of May, I think it's the 28th of May. And we're gonna be doing a gala in November. So I encourage people to go to our social media posts and follow us on that, because there's gonna be more information coming. Um, but we've finalized certain things that we wanna do and our board is very supportive of what, what's happening and getting back out in the community, because we can have better conversations when we see people and, and it's important. That's right. It's now, let, important. Let's talk about the foundation because mm -hmm. all the equipment, everything you see in the hospital is because of the foundation. Yeah, it's because of the donors that are coming through and, and uh, supporting what's going on. We, we do the uh, capital equipment. Uh, we'll be getting, we'll be receiving our, um, I don't want to say wish list, but we're going to get our, our big needs request coming here in the next couple weeks from senior management of the hospital team. And, and that will be our 2023, 2024 list of what we're going to be looking for and what we need to support and purchase. So um, along those lines, that's that's our role. We're here to steward funds within the community and uh, put it towards patient equipment. So that's how you find out what you what you need in the hospital. Right. OK. Right. Okay. <clears throat> You've got an MRI campaign coming we up. Do. So that's a big need. That's a big need. That's mm -hmm. a big ask. That's on top of Oh, the regular of, equipment okay. so yeah so I mean there's a there's big ass our capital equipment campaign is a 6.1 million dollar uh, ask that we need to do to purchase the you know we've sort of been given the license to get the get the unit mm -hmm. um, that is coming the groundbreaking will be happening shortly um, short timeline but the campaign is going to be over three years so we're not you know I mean we've just got to build on that and um, the MRI will be in Smith Falls. It'll be at our Smith Falls site. And um, yeah, lots lots happening there. But I think it's going to be amazing for our community. To, you don't want to say a one-stop shop, but I mean 20 minutes between any community is so much better than having to drive Brockville, Ottawa, whatever. And um, it's important. It's Absolutely. very important. Absolutely. I mean, you think of the leaps and bounds that we've, we've done at our local hospitals. Like, We've got a dialysis unit. We've got cancer care treatment yeah. uh, unit. We've got CAT scan. Now we're looking for we're uh, looking at the MRI. MRI, amazing. So we're very fortunate that we've been awarded that. So we're going to be working. We have a lot going on, and uh, you'll see a lot of us over the next little bit for sure. Absolutely. Now your your golf tournament. That's that's a big event for you yeah you know what and it, we kicked it off last year and this year the the response with the community and the players and sponsors um we're doing it again june 
16th, I think it is, to be very honest. I think it's the Friday, June 16th. Um, it will be held again at the Smith Falls Golf Club. We had uh, a great, great success and great working with them as well. So, I mean, that's, that's happening for June. And if anybody's interested, again, you know, get in touch with our office or and follow I mean, us on it, social media. It may seem early. I mean, we're in the middle of February. Happy Valentine's Day, Happy by the Valentine's way. Happy Valentine's Day. Yes, well, this is yes. February 14th. And yeah. We're taping this. And I didn't even bring but, your chocolates. Like, sorry. <laughs> that's all right. That's all right. Um, it, it seems like we're talking about it early, but you fill up so fast. Well, you know what? We're very, again, fortunate that we've got such great partners within our community and people that want to support the hospital like it you never know when you're going to need that hospital so it's nice to make sure we've got the up-to-date equipment that we've got so um, with the help from the community yeah it goes so we are just again working on sponsorship package it's going to be out shortly we'll be you know we'll be out there so yeah keep it in mind just follow us and, I mean, talk about partnerships in the community and everything, too. We've got the, the Pancake Supper with the Lombardi uh, Agricultural Society yeah. coming up February 21st, too. You've partnered up with them. We are. They, they were gracious enough to get in touch with us and ask if we'd like to, to be with them, and we're thrilled. We're, I don't know what we're doing yet, flipping pancakes, whatever, cleaning tables. We'll do whatever they tell us to do, but we're really um, appreciative of them reaching out to us. And you know, when I look at your, your board, your, your foundation board, you've got some great members on that. You've got some people that, you know, take this very seriously, yep. but they like to have fun. They like to have the, do the events. They go to the events. They, they're making connections as well, too. They're invested in our hospital. They're That's invested right. in the foundation. They are. So I mean, and their community. And their community. You know what? We, we, we are very, very fortunate, and they're very active. Um, we've always had a very active board through the years. Um, but with this, this board specifically, they are, are very active with it. And yeah, they, you put the ask out and they're there whenever they can be there. So we can't do it without them. That's right. That's right. Great uh, commitment from your board. For Absolutely. Sure, for sure. So 50-50. That's amazing what's 50, been going 50. on with that, how much you've raised for it. And you're yeah. going. Keep going. Yeah. 2022 brought in 100000 a little bit over 100000 We are doing it for 2023. The only difference for this year is we're going to be going every month. We're going to be working on a specific piece of equipment. So, you know, it, it just kind of brings in different departments. We want people to know that their money's going where it's, you know, I mean, there could be a certain area that you want to donate, which we always can do anyway. Mm -hmm. But um, it just sort of educates people with what is needed within the hospital. And it's just a different, you know, for us, it's get to, getting to know our staff getting to know what's happening there and finding out more about their departments. So that is going on. And, and again, you know, we we were very fortunate for Fev February. We're looking at um, anybody that's interested in sponsoring, the early bird sponsor. If they'd like to t reach out, call our office and say they're interested in it for a month. We've got, uh, some months are already full. This month is being, I think we've got the four early bird this month for February because it's a, you know, special Valentine's, you know, month. Mm -hmm. uh, Kelly's Flowers out of uh, Perth is uh, sponsoring those early birds. So, like I said, if anybody's interested in sponsoring a month, we'd be happy to hear from them. Excellent, excellent. So let's get some numbers out there because I know there's a... a okay. you got different websites, you got different Making numbers. Sure. So. Yes, absolutely. So our office number is 343-881-4483, which is GIVE. Um, and 5050 website, because we were only selling tickets through the website, um, is PSFDH Foundation 5050.ca. Our regular website is PSFDHFoundation.com. And we have a specific MRI website that will have all of the updated stuff, our groundbreaking any information that you're looking for, how to donate specifically to the don or to that, is the careclosetohome.ca. Excellent. So they'll all be linked. We'll have everything linked for, for people to find it easier, so. 